Hi, good day, good afternoon, good after morning, good evening, good night, and good of all the days. How are you guys doing today? It is the Black Social Scientist. How are you guys? So today's topic on the 25th of August, 2022, it is now three minutes past midnight in the UK, and it is three minutes past six in the Jamaican Caribbean, the US Canada, Central America time, varies between Central Pacific, Atlantic, so on and so forth. So Africa night now, Australia is tomorrow morning. So that's why the greeting and salutations. Hope you guys are well and listening. So thank you guys so much for checking out and listening to the Cast Society Instagram page, the Black Social Scientist Instagram page, and the Cast Society YouTube page. Okay, guys, also over on Facebook, too. I am the Black Social Scientist speaking, a criminologist, criminal sociologist, criminal sociologist, criminal psychologist, criminologist, social scientist, researcher, advocate, probation, parole, rehabilitation, advisor, placement, victims, witness, civil, criminal, contracts, research, in regards to predator loss and intelligence of crimes within Jamaica, that social psychopath and gang members, as well as many other titles. So one of the topics that I'm discussing in today's, it's a little overview because coming to talk to you guys real quick about a little topic. So what, how this is gonna work is, I'm gonna do this for a few of them. I'm gonna read something that I wrote and I'm going to paraphrase and em not paraphrase, sorry. I'm going to emphasize certain parts to make sure it's clear. And I'm going to use quote and quote when there's a paragraph or quotation marks used within it, as in it's a quote for sake of referencing. Okay, guys. Um, I want you guys to listen. Send me any questions you have about what I say, any comments, statements, queries, and I'll answer them back in the next message voice note whenever you guys send me so whenever i got get 10 i will then respond to them and then send them out accordingly okay guys so today i am discussing crime or criminology eugenics and the criminal type yep the criminal type that is a crime of criminal gilroy 2000 states that advertising companies use of racial types as as consumerism to represent exotic style or transgressive stance or the ideas of physical prowess or even prestige whilst the historic association of race with crime remained undisturbed ethnicity has undermined the credibility of race as gilroy 2000 claims it has receded, then if this is so, why is there still an association with race and crime in all its form of residual and discriminatory? There is still an association that criminals have biological and cultural differences inferior to people in quote unquote normal society. Cesio Lombroso, founding father, in a description of criminals and race, stating that races can be ranked on a hierarchy, that inferior race are identified by their physical features and inferior intellect. Rephrase and repeat, sorry. Cesio Lombroso, founding father in the description of criminals and race, stating that race can be ranked on a hierarchy, that inferior race are identified by their physical features and inferior intellect. Lambrosa argues that criminals were evolutionary throwbacks. European criminals had the features exhibiting physical and psychological features were anomalies for the whites, but state that other races were lower and less civilized. Lambrosa argues that criminals were evolutionary throwbacks or evolutionary throwbacks. European criminals had the features exhibiting physical and psychological features 
were anomalies for the whites, but state that other races were lower plus less civilized. He was, however, the first to assign measurements for body parts. This was to distinguish between normal and deviancy. Moral states and moral worth were said to be reflected by external physical features, example, skull, nose, ears, etc., alongside a little or light physical anomalies and stigmatata. This was from Lambrosos and Ferraris 2000s. Bad biological hereditary are destined by criminal. Repeat, moral states and moral worth were said to be reflected by external physical features, example, skull, nose, ears, etc., alongside a little physical anomalies and stigmatata. Bad biological hereditary are distinct by criminals. You follow what I'm saying? Bad biological hereditary or hereditary are destined by criminals. Conceptions of facial and racial analysis were, were respected scientifically. Conceptions of racial plus facial analysis was and were and is respected scientifically, thus laying the foundation for the idea that persons and populations are criminals in their looks and their racial looks. So they have a criminal type. Psychological, cultural, social, plus physical criteria were used to distinguish normality from deviancy, the non-criminals and criminals. Organic or physical abnormalities were complemented by social abnormalities. 19th century juxtaposed of the typical criminal gathered that crime patterns, young, male, poor, and with little education, and the average man equals law abiding with rational thought. Let me repeat what I just did. Psychological and cultural and social plus physical criteria were said to use to distinguish normality from deviance, the non-criminals and criminals. Organic or physical abnormalities were complemented by social abnormalities. 19th century juxtaposed of the typical criminals gathered from crime patterns stated young, male, poor, and with rich education, and the average men were law-abiding with rational thoughts. So as I said, guys, I wanted you guys to send me any questions, statements, statements, positions, queries, concerns about what I just read to you guys, elaboration, Ask me when I say a while ago, it not make no sense. All them things, yeah. I, mean, I know some of them, you're like, what, Miss Mona? It's like, what? I know, I know. Crime, eugenics, and the criminal talk. At Black Social Scientists, at CAS Society. CAS Society is C A triple S O C I E T Y. So it's C A S S and then Society. C A S S dot Society, Instagram, YouTube. Facebook, you can do the same thing, or Black Social Scientists. Okay, guys, looking forward to hear from you guys. If you guys need for any of my services, you guys can call me at 876-227-3462, 876-227-3462, or www.bnvirgo.com. So that's B for biology, N for nonsense, and virgo.com. All right, guys, pleasure speaking with you guys. Speak to you soon. Have a good rest of your evening.